Joining us today is head men's basketball coach Jason Zierman. Coach, you've had a little bit of time now to, to uh, digest the season, so you know what are your thoughts on a 19 and six overall record? Hey, you know, I thought we accomplished a lot during the year, and I thought our program was headed in the right direction and continuing that that direction. And uh, but at the end of the day, uh, you know, we didn't accomplish some of the goals that we set out for ourselves, and and we and we set the bar very high this year, and and we will continue to set that bar very high, and um, you know, so. It's bittersweet. Uh, it's looking back on the last year, last two years, last three years. You know, we we get to see what this senior class has helped us accomplish, and uh, so th that's great in looking back like that. But also uh, bitter in the fact that we wanted to keep playing. We wanted to be together as a group for another week, another two weeks, uh, and continue that finishing off the season the way it should have been finished off, and fell a little short of that. So, but looking looking back at the whole. You know, we, we've done some great things here, and they, these five seniors uh, should be very proud of that. You know, talk about, like, the bond that there was a forum between your team, and, you know, between the guys and uh, the coaching staff. You know, it started in August. You had a trip to Ireland, and then, you know, kind of a you know, long season, a lot of practices, a lot of games, a lot of road trips. And just talk about that, that bond that, yeah. that was developed. That's a great thing about uh, about sport, about athletics, is uh, the bond, the relationships you get to build with your, your teammates, uh, with your coaching staff, with your team. And we had a great experience of being able to go over to Ireland and uh, continue the success that we have uh, have started to have in the last couple of years. And, uh, and then bringing our freshmen in. And I thought we had a great freshman class uh, uh, this year to, to add to uh, that mix that went to Ireland and uh, continue now to start that, that bond. And continue to the bond uh, through the fall and in the spring is uh, is fairly uh, it's, it's easier because there's no uh, the bullets aren't flying the competition's not there you know there's no playing time involved so that's easy the, the bond that really when you when you really solidify that bond is is in the UA plays in the non-conference schedule getting ready for UA play and then into UA play and uh, you know our record in UA play this year in the last three years of has really spoke volumes for our uh, the bond that we've had with that team. You know, we talked. You mentioned a little bit of what previously the group of seniors that kind of came through have come through this program now, and just expound a little bit more on them and you know what what they've meant to this program. Well, they leave here, uh, you know, three winning seasons in a row. Uh, it's only been one, done one other time in Emory's history. It was in the uh, early late eighties, early nineties. Uh, they leave here, you know. With, uh, the number of wins, I think 61 wins they have, uh, three uh, 500 or better seasons in the UAA. Uh, you know, and we could spout off stats uh, that they leave here with, and uh, but most importantly, I think they they've left here and they've left a, a bar set for the the classes to come and the teams to come about about trusting each other, about committing to a program, and about caring about each other and showing it, and and, and that's what's so important about those five guys. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna miss them dearly. You know, talk about now. Obviously, it's the off season. And you got quite some time before you 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 get the uh, your next team to coach. But kind of what's you've met with them now. What's been the message, or what is going to be the message? You know, you know, coming up the rest of the school year and during the uh, upcoming summer. You know, we we always talk about getting better, and uh, that's what the message is. Every after every year is getting better, and uh, we got some big shoes to fill, and we got some guys who can fill those shoes. So we're we're looking forward to. Uh, taking the bar that those the groups ahead of them have set, uh, the seniors ahead of the, these guys have set, and taking that bar and raising it to the next level, carrying the torch from the past guys, and <clears throat> and then making that making that next step. You know, we, we, this program has to take a next step of you know, making the NCAA tournament and finishing the season off. And uh, you know, this this next group, you know, we're going to talk about that. And uh, you know, we've won 39 games and lost 11 in the last two years. To take that next step is, is going to be difficult. It's going to take guys, everybody buying in, and everybody getting better starting. And it's already started, and uh, we're looking forward to that. And uh, I'm looking forward to this next group stepping up and, and filling those shoes of some, some great guys that we just left behind. All right, Coach. Well, thanks very much for your time, and uh, we'll be talking to you down the road. Thanks, John.